Hello, in this video I'm going to give you an overview of how the Fast Woo Clickbank plugin works. So what you can see here is a store, a basic web store for some hypnosis downloads. And these are all being loaded into WooCommerce. And you can see the various prices that have been set. So if we add any of these to cart, so for example this one, and then go view the cart and proceed to checkout. You can see here we have the normal PayPal option. What we're going to do is change this to be actually payable through ClickBank. So what we're going to do next is come into our web store here and we're going to go into our WordPress dashboard. And if you haven't already done this, we're going to install the fast Woo ClickBank plugin and activate it. So once it's activated, you'll see inside the WooCommerce settings, there's going to be a new payment gateway. And if we come down here, we can see that basically that's the existing um, PayPal here, PayPal checkout, and then there's Stripe. So we can actually turn these off if you've got them enabled. And then we can come to the ClickBank setting, and then there's a ClickBank PayPal Direct. So we can enable both of these. And if we go into the actual setup, you'll see um, some details that you can change that will be present on the order form. Then you can add your vendor ID and your secret key here and then you can add a custom skin for the checkout and the order button text so if we just save these changes now and if we go back to our store you can see now we've got some new options and if we choose either of these after filling out this um, checkout form we're going to be taken straight to Clickbank so I'll just do that quickly to give you a demonstration so I've filled out the form and what I'm going to do now is place an order So you can see here that we've been redirected to Clickbank and the product that was in the cart is there available and it's come up in Australian dollars so I'm going to change that to US dollars so you can see this price. So the price there is $27 and then obviously if you're in a locality like for example I put Australia it's going to give you the local tax rate. So the your customer is just going to check out and anything that's been added to the cart is going to appear here. So Obviously, this is a, going to be a WooCommerce type store, so you're going to have multiple products in the car. So I'll give you a quick demonstration of that too. So we can actually add another product and then another product. And let's add another one. And then we'll go back to our cart and then proceed to checkout. So now you can see we've got our cart total and my details have been saved from before and we're just going to order now so now you can see there's multiple products in the clickbank cart and obviously if i change that to us dollars you can see i see the actual prices and then the tax has been added as well and then we've got our normal order bumps that are available within clickbank so we could add these as well and they will they will be kind of separate from the WooCommerce store. So let's have a look at the PayPal option because you can see here that we're paying by um, secure checkout and we've got PayPal here. We can go straight to check PayPal there. What we do have is the option to pay directly with PayPal. So say for example I add these items to cart. View the cart. So you can see we've got our cart, we've got our cart order here. Proceed to checkout. Details have been entered. So what we need to do basically is just click on PayPal. We can change the wording here so it'd be a bit more appropriate for your site. So just choose the PayPal option and then pay now. It will actually take your customer directly to the PayPal checkout. And obviously it's giving us a total in the Australian dollars with the taxes added but it's basically letting your customers know that there's an option for PayPal directly on your WooCommerce site and it will still track the sales through Clickbank and your affiliates will still get paid properly but it will actually let your customers go straight to PayPal without going to the Clickbank order form. So let's return to our site as the admin and we're going to actually look at the products. So we've got all products here 
basically each of these SKU numbers should be lined up with how you have your product IDs in within um, Clickbank so for example if we look at this product here we've got an SKU of 1 and if we go to Clickbank itself so with all your products that are existing inside Clickbank you'll, you'll have your item numbers down the side here and then you've got your price here so basically you just want to match these up with what you've got here inside WooCommerce store so you've got your SKU and your price so you can either do a quick edit on your existing products and make sure your SKU matches what's inside Clickbank and the price or you can actually when creating the products itself so if we just edit this quickly so when creating the product you can see the price here and then you've got the inventory so the SKU would be here and then there's some other general settings so we've got the vendor tracking ID the skin so each of the each of your products can actually uh, call upon a custom order skin so that when they're added to the cart individually and you want to check out skin for them you can have that and then you've got a flow ID so basically when you've got a one-click upsell so the Clickbank flow you put the flow ID here and that would initiate the um, upsell for these products so you want to kind of make sure that each of your products has the correct flow ID and there will be a priority between those products so it's for you to map out and plan where your flow flow IDs are going to go for each of your particular products and so the final step in this setup is actually to come back into your WooCommerce settings and then go to payments if we remember the Clickbank payment gateway that we enabled we want to just copy this IPN URL so we'll take this here highlight it and copy it and then if we go into Clickbank and we come down to the section in my site and we scroll down and we look for this section that's called advanced tools so once we're on advanced tools it, you'll see a section for instant notification URL you may need to enable this so if we edit I won't, I'm not going to edit this live site but basically if we edit this and you can pop in your URL and you can then verify it and that will link Clickbank to the payment gateway that you've set up within a WooCommerce here and allow the orders to be sent back to your WooCommerce site basically that's pretty much a quick overview of how the fast Woo Clickbank product works any questions feel free to reach out contact us through our support and our online chat